congratulations on your latest movie. Thank you. Appreciate you. Yeah, of course. Uh, you know, watching it on the big screen after, you know, shooting it, you know, years ago, uh, what do you think about the, the finished product? Is it anything like what you expected or are you sort of thrown for a loop seeing, uh, you know, uh, the finished product? I've only seen a couple scenes okay. during ADR. <laughs> I asked them to turn the screen off because it was scaring me just a little too much. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I am a huge scaredy cat, so it's ironic that I'm a part of this film, The Exorcism. It was really actually fun to create, to be honest. And it kind of lessened my fears a bit because I got to see what goes behind the scenes to make things scary, per se. Right. Yeah, well, yeah, that's great. I mean, yeah, I'm a huge wimp too. I don't know why I like horror so much. and. <laughs> My, my wife's always like, why do you, you're such a scary guy. <laughs> but no, I thought this was great. And, you know, I, I spoke to Ryan recently and they were talking about, you know, the how, and I agree. I thought it was interesting. The movie sort of explores, you know, the misogyny of Hollywood, this terrible director. And I was curious uh, what you thought about that. I mean, the, the themes of the movie, watching, you know, this movie within a movie experience and, and all that. If, Yes, I loved the themes that went along with this film, just aside from, you know, the scary part. You see and explore the relationship, the broken relationship of a daughter and her father. You explore the relationship between Blake and Lee as they fall in love. You explore and get to see how love conquers all, to be honest with you, and can truly fight any and everything, including demons. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely, well said. <laughs> I was also gonna ask, you know, you've made some super popular music with your sister, Hallie, and I was curious if you were, you know, you were so wonderful in The Exorcism as Blake, and I was curious, would you ever be interested in, uh, you know, co-starring with her in, you know, doing a serious movie together, if you have something in the works already? Absolutely, freaking lutely our synergy is through the roof so that's definitely in the books nice well that's great yeah and um, and yeah i mean and you yeah you have some wonderful for the exorcism you have some wonderful scenes with ryan simpkins and you know could you talk about uh you know working with ryan and uh if there was a lot of you know rehearsals beforehand you know to pull off those uh you know there was I, the, I thought those were the you know sort of the bright spot of the movie it, this it's very dark and intense but it was sort of nice to have those scenes where you guys are you know getting to know each other and all that yes love always shines outshines the darkness yes and Light. And I feel like our relationship was the little light, the little flicker of the candlelight throughout the film. I had an incredible experience working with Ryan. They were so much fun to work with. We had about a week and a half of rehearsals before. We were the only ones around the same age on set. So we would eat our lunches together. You know, we spent Halloween night together since we were stuck in Wilmington, North Carolina. We were like, what can we do for fun? And, you know, we ended up dancing in the rain on at a college party. Nice. <laughs> so <laughs> we definitely had a great time filming. They made me so comfortable having my first kiss on screen that wasn't with a man. And yeah, that was great. Well, yeah, that's awesome. Um, yeah, and then, yeah, you were wonderful. And, and are you working on something at the moment, whether as a composer or, uh, you know, performer? Love to yes. hear anything you yes. like there. I have my album Trouble in Paradise, you know, locked and loaded and ready to go and ready to be fired. It's a summer album, so I can't wait for it to be released. I finished wrapping this show called Fight Night. Uh, just a couple weeks ago and you know the preview actually dropped yesterday and i'm excited for it to release in september that was a really fun one to be acting alongside the likes of taraji b henson kevin hart samuel L. jackson so i'm definitely just reaching for the stars and staying booked and busy and doing my best yeah well yeah i mean in addition to those stars you just mentioned i mean you know and russell crowe i mean you've brush shoulders with some you know wonderful a-listers at this point i mean yeah looking ahead is there someone you know you've had your eye on that you'd like to work with 
who you haven't worked with yet, someone you're, you're like, you know, fangirling over, <laughs> anything like that. Denzel Washington, I would love to act alongside Angela Bassett again. I played her daughter in this movie called Meet the Browns when I was eight. So being able to do that now, I would absolutely love. Who else? Zendaya, I love her very, very much. Who else? Yeah, I think those are the top three that come to my mind right now, but I'm definitely a student of the craft and I can't wait to continue to grow. Of course. And you mentioned earlier how absolutely you'd love to work with your sister. Did you say, I missed what you said. Do you, are you working on something together at the moment or are you just saying that you would welcome the opportunity? To... Both. Both. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Nice. Yeah. But you can't share anything else about that. I mean, any would love to hear if, if you're able to share about the project you're working on together or maybe not. It's all in the works. All it's all in the works. Fair, fair enough. Be revealed in due time. <laughs> yeah. Did you, um, did you, you know, had you been a fan of Russell Crowe's work before, you know, joining the exorcism? Absolutely. So to be able to film alongside him was truly cool. Yeah. And he, you know, I didn't know what to expect. He is the sweetest teddy bear. He is so brilliant, so kind, and he welcomed me with a warm spirit and open arms and he's just great that's what i hear and it's <laughs> you know you see certain roles and you're like oh my gosh i find that hard to believe but then you hear what how wonderful he is i'm like oh well that's nice to hear <laughs> well great well thank you very much chloe i mean it was very nice to meet you i hope we can do this on the next one and i can't wait for everyone else to see the exorcism so congratulations i hope so as well thank you